Siempre dreaming of you. That's the saying on a new city landmark, a gateway into our south side neighborhoods. It's an art installation that's already turning heads thanks to its San Antonio folklore inspiration. Eyewitness News reporter Alicia Niaves joins us now live with our first look. Alicia. Hey Jeff, this started with a complaint from a south side resident who told the city councilman about a messy corner and eyesore off 35 in Sarsamora. After some research, the city found out they own the property, but because of land restrictions, they couldn't build anything commercial on it. That's when the idea of this art sculpture was born. A world without art is like a taco without salsa. It's good, but there's definitely something missing. You're looking at the Dream Song Tower. It's literally 70 feet of heavy metal, like it's, it's insane. An art sculpture by South San Antonio artist Cruz Ortiz. It says Siempre Dreaming of You, and it's really a love story. It's a take on a song by Selena, but the focus is on San Antonio folklore and history. A lot of it's dedicated definitely to the uh, folklore uh, myth. Uh, stories that, you know, our grandmas tell us. The facade has different cultural icons. So the chicken feet, which refers to the amazing Camaroncito dancers. Uh, you see the ojo, which is really my grandma's eye probably. <laughs> there's that, and then there's also the donkey lady, which this bridge uh, is where the donkey lady lives. Well, you know, a according to sure. myth. Uh, yeah, I'm pretty sure. The tower is designed to tell a story to bring back memories for many whose family members moved to the Alamo City long ago. So it's great that a community for a long time that hasn't always seen the first of, of investments has been overlooked or neglected in the past is getting to see something as, uh, as, as zesty, as spicy as art right in their backyard. Siempre dreaming of you pointing towards the north is a lot of the stories of, of the community members thinking about their own American dream, what inspires an imagination about young people and generations to aspire further and further. This could be the beginning of an art takeover on the south side. Saldana says they also want to beautify the underpass right across from the tower. Early next year, after some landscaping and sidewalks are put in, the project will be complete. Alicia Neaves, Ken's 5 Eyewitness News. All right, Alicia, thank you for that.